So this dentist called Kenzo Tenma saves a kid called Johan who got shot in the forehead. Tenma doesn't fuck with the higher ups of the hospital for some reason and vents to the kid like, man, I wish these virgins just dropped dead and Johan's like, I bet. Poisons the director and yeets from the hospital with his twin sister Anna like a giga chat. So these two are results of a eugenics experiment to create the perfect human. Yeah, it's exactly as racist as it sounds. A few years after their birth, these two insults came up to the mom like, yeah, we're gonna take one of those and psychologically harm them for the rest of their life and the mom's like oh this one no this one no this one no fuck which one who put identical clothes on the twins she gives up Anna and Johan's like fuck was she supposed to give me like does this bitch even know what she's doing and Anna returns like yeah dozens of people died kind of predictable and Johan's like oh my god I was like literally there they burn down their house wonder off Johan kills some people and they're eventually discovered and sent off to separate orphanages Anna gets into a regular one but Johan's sent into another fucking Nazi experiment called Kinderham 511 where kids are brainwashed to become psychopaths but Johan already being one is like this is kind of nice starts a rebellion which ends in all the workers and children killing each other and he fucks off again like get a load of this guy right what a fucking legend the twins then get adopted by a wealthy couple with the last name Lieber Johan kills them and urges Anna to shoot him so he winds up in the hospital where Tenma takes care of him and yada 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 after escaping from the hospital Anna is adopted by loving foster parents and Johan spends time in multiple foster homes starts a money laundering scheme at age 15 and makes hella bank. Motherfucker, I couldn't even do laundry when I was 15. <laughs> what the hell? After some years of scheming in the underworld, Johan decides to hire serial murderers to kill his former foster parents, cause, you know, and then gets rid of the killers, but one of them manages to survive and gets treated by none other than motherfucking Tenma. Johan pops in to say, hi, remember me? Are all your values as a doctor crumbling yet? They fucking oughta. Seeing Johan commit murder urges Tenma to begin his manhunt for this psycho, which ends up making him a prime suspect in like 17 murders that were actually committed by Johan or someone he hired, and man, this cat and mouse chase is just phenomenal, but am I gonna go through all of it in this video? Nope. Fuck you, go read it. Basically, in a nutshell though, after years of yes, no, yes, no, Tenma finally catches up to Johan and has him cornered, only for Johan to get shot by some random drunk guy. Tenma then operates on Johan once again, cause that's a nice full circle, and after a time skip, Tenma is seen talking to a comatose Johan, which is followed up by the single most horrifying scene in all of Animanga. We're left with the question, was it a hallucination? Who is the real monster? Where did Johan go?